What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite homegirl, Gossip Girl. Happy Sunday to you all. So, I just want to come in and talk to you about um, the passing of Alex Trebek. Um, we all know him as the host of Jeopardy. And it is stated here that he has been battling pancreatic cancer. Okay? Um, and it's sad. You know, it's really, really sad. Um, TMZ has reported that a Jeopardy spokesperson told them um, Jeopardy is saddened to share that Alex Trebek passed away peacefully at his home early this morning, surrounded by family and friends. Um, Alex Trebek, you know, he's been the Jeopardy host since 1984. Um, he had a calm but witty presence about him and I grew up watching Jeopardy, you know, I grew up watching Jeopardy. Um, the TV icon had been battling stage four pancreatic cancer since announcing the news back in March of 2019. Um, he immediately started the chemo after the diagnosis, but made no plans to retire and continued hosting his game, his game show as impressively as ever. He did. I remember when he first announced it. That he had pancreatic cancer and he was still doing it he was still hosting he was still hosting and i was like wow you know it takes you know to sit with chad bozeman he i mean for years he been going you know going through what he was going through and he gave us movies and you know and it's like you never know what somebody is battling you know, they may not show it, you know, and when it starts to show, you may think, oh, they probably just trying to lose weight for a movie or something else. But, you know, Alex Trebek, I remember when he, you know, announced that he had pancreatic cancer and he was getting, you know, he was doing his treatments and he was still hosting the show. That right there is, takes some type of strength. I'm telling you, for him and Chad, Chadwick Boseman, um... Chad, for him to be giving us movies and all that he was doing while he was going through what he was going through, it's crazy. It's amazing. It's crazy, but it's amazing at the same time because it's like, wow, like, you know, some people will take time off to deal with that, but people deal with their own type of pain and news the way they want to deal with it. They handle things differently. So... Alex Trebek has passed away, unfortunately. You know, rest in peace to him. My condolences to his family. He was on TV doing Jeopardy since 1984. And here it is, 2020. You know what I'm saying? Like, wow. Oh, I tell you. Honey, let me tell you something. Life is too short. Life, take, enjoy life as you can because you never know. Now, they said the death comes in threes. We already know about Alex Trebek. Um, unfortunately, King Vaughn. I don't want to hear about nobody else passing. You know, because, you know, my grandmother always say, well, you know, when one person passed away, then two more come right behind it. And, oh, my God, sometimes she'd be right. And I'm like, we don't need that right now. But, yes, Alex Trebek has passed away. You know, rest in peace to him. And my condolences to his family. I don't think there's going to be anybody to fill those shoes. I think Jeopardy needs to just go off the air. Because I can't see anybody playing, you know, being the next host for Jeopardy. And I know they're not going to take the show off the air. But I just don't know. And I just can't see the next person hosting Jeopardy. I just don't. I don't have not one clue in my mind. Who could host Jeopardy and bring that same type of witty and, you know, calm presence like Alex Trebek did. I mean, everybody do things in their own little way. But when you think of Jeopardy, you think of Alex Trebek. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah. It's, a, it's such it's sad. It's really sad. But you know what? <sighs> He's been fighting, you know. He, he fought through it for a while. He fought through it for a while. 
But anyway, guys, that's all I have to share. And I will talk to you later.